That's just how it is, folks. And look, everybody's like, oh, Donald Trump is so racist. Donald Trump is racist. Page 45. He don't like these people from other countries. We should allow everybody just to come on in because we're such a great big old country. And we can take care of everybody. Because I believe in rainbows and butterflies. Meanwhile, they're bitching about how there's crime going on. Donald Trump is trying to prevent crime. But, 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 but Donald, those thousands of people, there's only a few bad seeds. But we should let those people in. We should let all those people in. Because, you know, 99 of them, 99 of those 100 people are wonderful people. Only one of them is a mass murderer. But you should go ahead and let all the 100 in because, you know, only one of them is bad. Well, one is a mass murderer, for example. See these dum-dums? I've got dum-dums here. They're not immigrants, just dum-dums. So I've got, what, five dum-dums here. Five dum dums. Okay? Look at this. Look at this. Look at this cherry one. All right, they all look wonderful and great. They're all fruity and nice and everything. Well, guess what? I dipped one of them in poison. One of them is in poison. One of them is dipped in poison. But you know, the other four of the five, the other four are wonderfully delicious and they won't hurt anybody. They won't hurt anybody at all. So why don't you allow these dum-dums into your mouth? Because they're so great. One of them will kill you. One of them, maybe this one, maybe that one, maybe this one, maybe that one, maybe this one. One of them will kill you. But they're all so delicious and great. We should let them all in. You know what? Hmm. They all just came in. I guess I'll have a dum-dum. <laughs> That's exactly how it is, folks. That's exactly how it is. What, am I radical for saying that? Am I radical for saying that one of these dum-dums could have been poison? I think what's one of the Trumps got in trouble for saying there's a bag of Skittles and one of the Skittles is poison dark. It's the truth. That's just how it is, folks. And what's happening, and there's, there's individuals coming here. There's people who are left come up unchecked who come in this country. And unfortunately, when you live in a certain area, you are immune to certain diseases. If you move to another area, you can bring those diseases here, and we're not immune to that. And people go, well, look at the smallpox blankets that we gave to the Indians, and we killed the Indians. Precisely. So what's happening, folks, is... We come over here, they come over here with their children, not proper vaccines, and if they get up vaccines, that's great, but they have these diseases, these misty diseases, and I urge you to look it up. There are so many children out there who now have these polio type diseases. They're the mystery diseases. We don't know how to fight them, and they're they're being crippled. Blah, blah, blah. Luckily, not many of them are dying from it. But guess what? Nobody wants to say it. But it's the truth. It's coming from children from other countries that we've taken in. Illegal people that we are taking in. And they're hurting our nation's youth. That's one of the problems. I'm not radical. I love all people. I want to be able to eventually help people. But that's what America First is about for people. America First it means we take care of ourselves first. People go, but, but you got to take care of other people in the world. Well, I'm sorry. We won the lottery. We won the nation's lottery. 
the world's lottery. We were born in the United States, one of the best places to be born. I'm sure there's other places in the world that would be great for to be born too, but this is one of the best places in America, the best places to be born. We have to take care of our own people first. Our own people. I mean, honestly, we have to take care of our own people first. That's what America's first is for. If you're on an airplane, those oxygen masks broke, break, drop down. You know, and you got your little kids there. They tell you, what's the first thing you do? You put the oxygen mask on yourself first. Why do you do that? You put the oxygen mask on yourself first because without you, you're not there to help the others. So that's why it's America first. How hard is that? 